In this episode, we're going to look at installing Docker for Mac. And frankly, this is one of the easiest places to install Docker in my experience. If you head over to the docker.com website, however, there's not a really simple place to get the actual install that you want. It's not listed on the homepage for some reason. Sure, you could go to this Get Started with Docker link and download this Docker toolbox, but that's not actually what you want. So what you need to do instead of clicking on that download Docker toolbox is just do a simple uh, Google search for Docker for Mac. So we're gonna do Docker for Mac real quick. The first link is installation on OS X, which is great, that's what we want. There's a uh, go to getting started with Docker for Mac link right here. We need to click on that. And on this page, this is where you're going to find the actual download. Don't ask me why it's convoluted at this point. Maybe it's because the Docker for Mac official release has just recently come out of beta. Hopefully this will become easier to find over time. But for now, you know, not terribly difficult. Just scroll down here a little bit and you'll find the Docker for Mac installation. You definitely want to grab the stable channel, not the beta channel. Beta is if you want all the latest and greatest features and want to be able to do things that the stable channel doesn't have yet. But really, I think the stable channel is pretty darn solid. So I'm going to go ahead and download that. And as you can see, it's going to take a few seconds to download here. Not terribly large, 110 megs. Once we have that downloaded, we can show that inside of our finder. Looks like I already had a previous copy of it downloaded as well. So I'm going to go ahead and run the docker.dmg file. We'll just drag and drop docker.app into our application folder. And in my case, I actually need to replace it because I've already got it installed. But here's the deal. Once you've done that, once you've drag and dropped docker.app into your applications folder, you're done. That's really, that's it. It's that simple. Now, I am going to go ahead and run the Docker app. So I'm going to close this, go to my applications. Where does that? There it is. And double click on docker.app. And once I do that, I've got this little thing say, okay, confirm, this is from the internet, hit open anyways. And now I've got this nice little screen that pops up saying Docker has been updated, yay! We're now in version 1.12, I can close that. And we have Docker up and running in the uh, system toolbar right here. So that's pretty much it. You've got Docker installed, it's available to use. You can do anything you need with Docker at this point on your Mac, including opening up a console and writing docker dash dash version to see that we have Docker version 1.12 build whatever that hash is right there. So there we go, that's it. That's for all you really need to do to install Docker on Mac.